Mr. Kate! <gasps> Hi guys, Kate here from Mr. Kate. I am standing in front of a giant art piece that I just finished. I was inspired by nature and I wanted to show you guys how you could use anything like things from your backyard to create art and get a huge statement piece for your wall, living room, bedroom, wherever you want to put it. So here's how I did it. So I came up with this pattern based off of this guy, William Morris. Hmm, who is this guy? Well, he was an interior designer at the turn of the 20th century and he was inspired by the Industrial Revolution in a negative way because the Industrial Revolution was bringing all this soot and dirt and making people's lives really hard. And what makes people's lives really happy and peaceful is nature. I wanted to bring in nature in even a more literal way and actually put some friggin' moth on my canvas. So I actually brought in nature. I used raffia, one of my favorite things. You can wrap presents with it. And hey, you can glue it on the canvas in a nice little scrolly way. I use sand, black sand, terracotta sand. I love textural stuff. I mean, whenever you can play with something in artwork that has a three-dimensionality about it, I think it really just makes it something fun and impactful for your walls. If you don't have black sand or terracotta sand in your backyard, they have it at Michael's. If you have a Michael's in your backyard, you're really lucky. Right now, my bird kind of looks like it has an ass explosion but it's a pretty one. Popcorn, pistachio shells, berries, those I found on the side of the road. Hot glue, paint, so a little step by step. I started out painting it blue. I got this giant canvas at the art store. I really think big pieces of art make a huge impact in your room, and if you make your own, you can play up any color palette you want. I freehand drew this pattern, but you could totally do your own pattern. Hot glue, my best friend. A little bit of Elmer's glue is what I use to stick the sand onto the canvas. Spray it to seal, and you're good. Oh, I hope you guys got inspired by nature as I did. I really want to see what you guys do, your nature-inspired projects, so always send them Kate at Mr. Kate. And, you know, art is a portal to nature.